Hey, this is Chris with vidsociety.com and in this video, I am going to do a local reputor review for you guys. This is a product, if you have a local marketing business and if you want to be able to offer additional services or find clients who need local reputation management, this is a great tool that gives you several options to offer different types of services that they might be interested in as well as finding leads who are interested in those services. Now below this video, I'll put a link that will take you to my website where you can get even more details about local reputor as well as uh, details on the upsells, the pricing, and even some bonuses if you happen to buy it through my website. Okay, so when you first log in, this is what you're gonna see and you have two choices. You can either get started or find leads. So obviously finding leads is gonna help you to find the leads that needs these services. Getting started is gonna help you to offer the services to those leads. So we're gonna go ahead and click on get started. And the first thing we're going to see is a list of folders that we have created to help us organize everything. So I'm just going to leave these the way they are. And what I'm going to do is start here by creating a new widget. Because what these widgets do is they allow your clients to be able to easily collect reviews on Google, Yelp, and Facebook for their business, which is huge for businesses, especially today. And so what I'm going to do is let's just go ahead and type in a campaign name here of Client6 and we'll put it in the folder for demo and click next. So these are the four types of widgets you can create, customize, and add to your client's websites to collect reviews. And the first one here is your simple pop-up box which shows up on their homepage or any other page on their website that you put the code on. And you can edit anything in this box. So if you click on would you recommend us, you can change the text. And over here on the left hand side you can, left -hand side, you can see where you can turn on or off any of these features. And along with that, you can edit the text and you can even edit the font, the font size, the color, and the formatting of it. Now down here, you can see where you can leave a link so where people can review them on Google, Facebook, and Yelp. These can be turned on or off depending on if they have access to these services, which if they don't, just gives you another opportunity to offer that service to them. Now the next one is the floating bar. So this one just shows up at the top of their screen. Then we have the slide out option, which shows up on the side of their screen. And then the box, and the box just shows up on the bottom right hand corner here. And what's great about this too, is if you scroll clear at the bottom, you got the positioning option where you can choose where you want that box to show up at. You also have some animations here you can choose as to how that box uh, shows up. And then in these three boxes is where you're going to put the text for them to click on the buttons and then to go to the URL. So if you don't know where the URLs are for each of these to leave a Google, Facebook, or Yelp review, you can click the links here and it'll take you and show you how to do that. Now once that's done and you choose which one of these you want, say for example we want this box one, we can choose generate a widget and it's going to give us a code. Now since I didn't put any links in here, it's giving me an error, so let me go ahead and turn off Yelp and Facebook and then for Google I'll just type in a link here. We'll just put google.com and then click generate widget. And you can see now we have this code and all you have to do is just put this in the body tag on the page where you want it displayed. If you have a client that has a WordPress website or even if it's your own website, what you can do is just simply install a WordPress plugin that allows you to insert header and footer code and it, they, they normally all have the option for also body code. And you'd simply just paste this in there and it would show up on every site. So for example, I have this included on a test site that I built called CAD Locksmith. And if I refresh this page, you'll notice in the bottom right hand corner, this box pops up and here we have our link to review us on Facebook. And this is huge for local businesses. They love for clients to leave reviews. And of course that also helps them in the Google My Business and Yelp and Facebook and all these other places where they're advertising to get more exposure and for people to see that they are a legit business and to get really good reviews. Okay, so not only can you offer this as a service, but if you go up under Get Reviews, you also have the option to create QR code products for your clients and sell it to them. So let me go ahead and just click on the plus here to create a QR code, and we're going to name this, uh, we'll just call it Client 6 QR, and we'll put this in the folder called Review and click Next. And then we get to choose a canvas size. So we can create QR codes for our clients for business card sizes um, or a bigger card size or even a flyer. And so I've been seeing these a lot more, especially in local restaurants. 
of businesses that are putting these up along the wall beside of booths and tables that people can just scan while they're sitting there to leave reviews and I thought that was a really good idea and this makes it super easy to do that so all you have to do is click next most businesses they don't know how to do this stuff they have no idea how to get a QR code and so this is a, a really good service you can offer now you can completely customize this with a drop and drag editor all you have to do is choose a background you can upload your own image you can search for images on pixabay or you can just choose a simple collar for this example I'm just going to choose a collar and then you can add additional images if you want to to this so once again you can upload your own or you can search on pixabay you can add your own text and then you can resize it you can move it to wherever you want to so we can just click in the box and we can type review us or whatever you want it to say and then you can add emojis and then down here is your QR code so if you click on that it's going to ask you to put in the URL of the website you want it to take them to when they scan that QR code now the QR code can redirect to a website if you want it to uh, a, a restaurant I was in the other day I actually saw where if you scanned it it took them straight to their menu because a lot of restaurants don't like giving out menus right now uh, because of what's going on so they can just scan this QR code it takes them to their online menu or you can send it to their review page on Google Yelp um, Facebook or any other site you want them to and we're just gonna put in we'll just put in Google for example click Save and then it gives you this QR code here you can resize it you can move it around put it anywhere you want on the card click Save and done and then it lets you download it to your computer and then what you can do you can either have this printed off and give it to your clients or you can just give them the design and then they can take it and have it printed so this is a really good service that can be offered to all different kinds of local businesses and next what we have are the option to get leads so if we come over here to hot leads and let's say we want to find businesses that we can sell these services to we'll do find leads and let's just type in we'll just type in restaurant and we'll do Cincinnati Ohio click search and then all you have to do is just give it a couple minutes it's going to find all these businesses it's going to load them and right now they're grayed out because it's collecting the data once it collects all the data for it you'll see that they'll show up better and you can see it and then this tells you a lot about these businesses you have their name the rating how many reviews they have whether their GMB listing is claimed which is really good because this is a simple way to uh, sell a service to a client if they haven't claimed their Google my business listing you can do that for them you can see here if they have an email phone number or a website so if they don't have a website that's another option for you to offer them another service so we can scroll down through here and you can see the majority of these restaurants are claimed in this area but if they weren't the option would be here you could go there you could see it uh, you can get in touch with them over here under actions it gives you the contact details you can add these to manage leads so you can um, well I'll, sh I'll show you here in a minute and then you can also generate the report so if we click on manage leads we can choose let's just put it under donut I guess click add and then we can go under manage leads and we'll find the folder for donut and then this here is the one that we just added and it has their information here and we can mark it if it was claimed or unclaimed but we can actually claim their listing through this and then you can choose here if they were contacted no respond pending respond or deal secured now it goes a lot further than this even not only can you claim their listings through the software but you can edit their listings just like you would as if you went to Google my business and this makes it really easy to do that so if we come up to hot leads and go to optimize and let's choose uh, this site here you can see their status has been verified that one's unverified we can go to optimize listing and under here it brings up the optimization my Google business listing and this is really neat because it gives you full control over the ability to edit their Google my business page and it syncs it up and so you have business info you have services info which can all be edited you even have posts and this is really cool because what this does let me go ahead and click on plus this allows you to actually create a post that shows up on their listing and these can be offers so if it's a restaurant it could be a special deal they're doing maybe for even a couple days and you would simply upload a photo here put in the title we could say one day 
offer and you can see down here at the bottom how it shows up as you're editing it the date and the time the details of the offer we can turn this on and we can enter in all that information and this is what shows up then when people searches for their business and it makes it super easy for you to edit it and manage it for them and then if they give you a photo you can upload of maybe uh, the food or, or the special or whatever service it is they're offering you can upload that and that will also show up here you can edit their photos here that they have notifications and also under attributes you have all that here I'm not going to go through every one of these settings um, there'll be a lot more details on the sales page which you can find a link for that if you visit the link under this video uh, but but it gives you full control to do all this stuff and then you also have review inbox and this allows you to manage the reviews for the Google pages that you have synced up with your account here so you can go here and click on uh, let's just go here to Google page click next and it's going to show you here the reviews that are saved on here you can reply to them you can mark them as resolved you can ignore them it gives you full control over helping the clients with their uh, reputation management which is what a lot of clients really need right now uh, overall a super product it gives you a lot of options for adding a lot of services uh, even finding the leads for these services. I, I do recommend Local Reputor. I think it's a great product. Like I said, below this video, I'll put the link that will take you to my site so you can get more details about it and you can find out the pricing. There are, I believe, I uh, think three upsells. There may be more than that now. I'll keep that updated on my website and I'll also make sure that the pricing's updated so you know exactly what you're going to have to invest in if you want to get the all the features that you want out of Local Reputor. Other than that, that's my review on Local Reputor. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave them below. And I will try to get to them as soon as I can. Thanks.